Hey, I got a quick video for you. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can make your very own Ching ring. What's up everyone, CJ here. I hope you're all doing well. Drumming accessories can be really fun. I mean, we have the big fat snare drum head, we have tambourines for our hi-hats, and so many more accessories. The downside, of course, is that if you wanna get all of these different accessories, it's gonna get pretty expensive. But it's also really simple to make these accessories by yourself, and you can get away with it pretty cheap. So for this video, I'm gonna show you how you can make your own Ching Ring. The Ching Ring is a pretty dope accessory, and a lot of companies have started to make those. I think Meinl is making one version, and Big Fat Snare Drum is making one. And since a lot of drummers have started using those, a lot of companies want in on the action. So instead of spending a lot of money on these items, why not make it yourself? Now, let me show you what you need to make your own Ching Ring. If you wanna see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button to stay updated. Thank you for supporting my channel. Now let's do this. So to make this as cheap as possible, what you will need is an old drum head, a tambourine, some paper fasteners, a pair of scissors, and a box cutter. I used an old drum head for my eight inch tom and cut out the drum head from the rim. I didn't use any precision tools, but with a pair of scissors and the box cutter, I guess the head wound up about six and a half to seven inches in diameter. As you can see, it's not a perfect shape, but hey, if you're not David Raouf, you gotta work with what you got. Then make small incisions with your knife or box cutter in five well-placed areas of the head. Now take the shingles from your tambourine. I got this tambourine in a second hand shop and I paid about $2 for it. Most old wooden tambourines like this have pretty loose nails and you can actually wiggle them out with your fingers. If it's complicated, I suggest you get a pair of pliers. Now take the paper fasteners and put them through the shingles and the drum head and then fold out the arms. And there you go, you just made your own ching ring. Let's try it out on the drums. It's by all means not perfect, but it definitely works. And you can actually save a few bucks by making one of these yourself. As you can see, it's not that hard. 
If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not a subscriber yet, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to stay updated whenever I release a new video. Thank you so much for watching everyone and good luck with your drumming. I'll see you soon.